Hello everyone. Today we are back again in another iteration of success stories at Coding Blocks, and we have brought Mudit Chapati here along with us. So Mudit is a proud DTU student, currently into his fourth year, I believe. Am I right, Mudit? Yeah. All righty. And Mudit was also a student of uh, Karthik Mathur Bhaiya here at Coding Blocks. He pursued his programming in C++, if I'm not wrong. Great, great. So, guys, Mudit has been selected as ACS intern at Mastercard, and we are here to know the experience of Mudit. So, uh, over to you, Mudit. Uh, first thing first, how are you? How are you doing today? I'm good, and I'm going good today, and I'm quite excited for the new interview. Great, man. Great. Even I'm very excited to know more about Mastercard because uh, there are a few of my friends who are already working there, so I would like to know like what's the actual uh you know work culture there and how it's all about right mm-hmm. so okay. let's begin with this you know interview so at all first mudit can you please tell me uh, when did you start your coding journey so uh, i start from my 11th and 12th at that time i had no experience in coding and i did not had any subjects regarding the coding and programming and all um, in the first year of my college in the first day actually uh, i realized that coding is something that i must know so then i started to doing uh, this programming and coding in python and where mm-hmm. i got to know about the dsa and all so but very soon i realized that uh, coding uh, coding in python is not going to help me in getting sd placements so if i talk about that if i consider my placement to be a block then i can further can divide this placement block into the three parts tech placement non tech placement and semi tech placements so tech placement generally comprises of this programming part and uh, the other computer subjects like uh, uh, coding uh, computer networks os and dbms uh, if uh, if i talk about the semi tech then it's python and uh, uh, sql majorly and in non tech you have guesstimates and uh, uh, this uh, case studies and all so uh, for getting a placement in the tech area uh, i must have knowledge about the programming and that to in uh, uh, java as well as c++ um, the both can work so i started and so, so i planned that uh, i must start the uh, this uh, programming in c++ so in the third semester i joined uh, coding blocks uh, in the c++ launchpad batch where uh, kartik bhaiya was my mentor and within a span of 4 to 5 month he completed the dsa with full clarification and uh, i learned the dsa there and uh, it was quite good the experience was quite good and i got to know what more about that uh, dsa part in that batch then okay okay yeah so like uh, coding box ke bare mein aapko refer kisne kara tha sabse pehle so uh, at that time the uh, call uh, the this uh, in in my college there are seniors which have taken the, the courses from coding blocks so mm-hmm. from there only i got to know that coding blocks can help me getting placement in that tech area okay so, so matlab aap ye bhi kehna chahte ho ke seniors ke advice to bhi le ni chahiye uh-huh. right सीनियर्स हाँ सीनियर्स काफी अच्छा इम्पैक्ट डालते हैं हमारे ऊपर बिकॉज जो ऑलरेडी सेलेक्ट हो सक हो चुके हैं उनकी शॉर्टकमिंग्स भी पता लगती है और उनका एक्सपीरियंस भी पता लगता है जो कि काफी हेल्पफुल होता है ओके okay. एंड जो आपके सीनियर्स थे जिन्होंने आपको कोडिंग ब्लॉक्स के बारे में रिकमेंड करा वो अभी कौन सी कंपनी में मेजरली माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एंड गूगल में भी हो चुके हैं सेलेक्ट एंड बिग मेजरली लाइक फैंग में भी थे स्प्रिंकलर में भी थे सो इन सब में जो सेलेक्ट हो चुके थे मैं उनके काफी टच में रहता था एंड फ्रॉम देर आई गॉट दैट वॉइस It was quite helpful. Okay, okay. So, can you please tell me more about like what is this ACS intern kind of thing at Mastercard? So, ACS stands for Associate Consultant, uh, in in which I will be dealing with the Python models, Hadoop, Impala, this kind of tech stack, where I will be working majorly on the this uh, big data sort of things. Okay, got yeah. it, man. So, uh, hopping on to the next question, Mudit. Uh, can you please tell me like how did you keep yourself motivated throughout this journey so as i have told you that uh, seniors are, uh, is a quite a source of uh, this inspiration as well as mai kya karta tha ki unke sath mai touch mein bhi rehta tha and unse mai poochta bhi rehta tha ki like how is the work culture there because uh, when they told us about the work culture it gives me a sense of motivation sort of thing like ab to jana hai yahan pe mujhe bhi experience karna hai so that uh, that is the first point like senior se interaction now second mera ki ye tha ki mai jab bhi thoda sa aise demotivated ya fir thoda sa packed feel karta tha at that time i used to read the articles uh, jo already 
आर्टिकल्स जैसे कि जो एक्सपीरियंस वाले आर्टिकल्स आते हैं जैसे कि लीड कोड पे आ गया जीएनजी पे आ गया इन सब पे आ गया तो मैं इनको ही पढ़ता था और कभी कभी इंटरव्यूज भी देख लेता था जैसे यूट्यूब पे जो लाइव होते हैं जैसे मेरा अभी चल रहा है अच्छा 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 गॉड इट तो लाइक व्हाट डू यू थिंक आर द इम्पोर्टेंट टॉपिक्स फॉर टेक्निकल इंटरव्यूज अभी तक आई बिलीव आपने काफी टेक्निकल इंटरव्यूज दिए होंगे सो द फर्स्ट इंटरव्यू व्हिच आई गेव वाज इन द स्प्रिंकलर एंड इन स्प्रिंकलर दे मेजरली आस्क मी अबाउट माय प्रोजेक्ट्स एंड देन प्रोजेक्ट्स के बाद दे टोल्ड मी की दे आस्क मी टू राइट अ सुडो कोड ऑफ मच शॉर्ट व्हिच आई गेव और व्हिच आई मतलब इट वाज क्वाइट इजी then uske baad the the question that they asked was related to dp and dp was and the topic of dp it was related to graph plus dp sort of thing uh, it was quite okay. tough uh, yeah mm-hmm. but uh, and they told me ki uh, tell me the steps ki how will you approach this problem so i okay. told them my approach and they asked me to write a pseudo code sort of thing but i was uh, doing the code but uh, at that time my time got up so uh, in the first interview i got selected for the second interview mm. they asked me from scratch from time time complexity to the whole sort of thing like graph till graph unhone me se sari cheeze short mein puchi like link list ke bare mein bhi puch liya then graph ke bare mein bhi uske baad arrays ke bare mein bhi puch liya 2d arrays yeah so i think okay. if, I, uh, if i combine this then graph mm. dp then uske baad trees are the most important topics according to me so far okay okay great so लाइक like, आपने जो भी आपकी स्ट्रेटजी थी डीएसए को स्टडी करने के लिए या जो भी आपने प्रिपरेशन करी थ्रू आउट दिस ऑल द टाइम सो व्हाट डू यू थिंक इज द परफेक्ट स्ट्रेटजी फॉर अ डीएसए प्रिपरेशन सो इफ यू आर अ बिगनर जस्ट लाइक आई वाज सो मैंने अपनी प्रिपरेशन स्टार्ट की जैसे मेरा एक टॉपिक होता था लेट्स सपोज एरे मैंने पढ़ा देन उसके बाद मैं हैकर रैंक पे क्योंकि हैकर रैंक इज द बेस्ट फॉर बिगनर्स सो वहां पे उस टाइप के सारे क्वेश्चन मिल जाते थे बिगनर्स लेवल के देन आई यूज टू सॉल्व देम देन उसके बाद अगर मुझे थोड़ा सा लेवल रेस करना होता था देन मैं लीड कोड पे जाता था और फिर टैग लाके क्वेश्चन करता था फिर जैसे मैं जैसे मेरा एक टॉपिक हुआ देन उसके बाद ये सेम स्ट्रेटेजी और जब मेरा पूरा डी हो गया था देन मैंने टैग लगाना छोड़ दिया बिकॉज टैग से मतलब आपको पता लग जाता है कि ये क्वेश्चन इससे ही सॉल्व होने वाला है बट इफ यू डोंट यूज अ टैग देन Uh, आपका नेचुरल माइंड चलता है तो वो काफी हेल्प करता है सो आफ्टर कंप्लीटिंग द होल डीएसए यू मस्ट गो फॉर लीड कोड एंड कोड शेप जहां पे आप डिफरेंट डिफरेंट दिस कॉन्टेस्ट देते हैं जहां पे आपको अपने एक्चुअल क्या क्या पता लगता है गॉट इट गॉट इट सो अपार्ट फ्रॉम दिस लाइक और भी अदर वे रिसोर्स आप सजेस्ट करना चाहते हो अपने कोई जूनियर को या फिर किसी फेलो मेट को तो आप सजेस्ट करना चाहोगे सजेस्ट तो आई मीन गो फॉर डीएसए और थोड़ा बहुत वेब डेवलपमेंट and right. uh, uh, computer subjects also plays very important role uh, like mm-hmm. os on dbms are way more than us than this computer networks after coding so right. go for this computer subjects and programming programming ko to achhi karni hai got it acha one thing more which i personally feel like that there are a lot of free resources on internet which are available for dsa for web development the let's say up to sab cheezon ke liye hi available hai so yeah. what is this one thing which convinced you to purchase a paid program at coding blocks versus not going with the free resources which are easily available on the internet and youtube the main thing is the routine majorly agar aap online mein padhte rehte hain to then aapko ye lagta hai ki chalo theek hai to padhai hua hai to matlab koi routine set nahi ho pata hai but when you have an offline course then aap aapke upar foundation hai ki aapko jana aur seekhna hai and routine is the most important thing consistent consistency basically so jaise mera har week mein do uh, days ka hota tha weekends pe so mera ek routine set ho chuka tha ki aur main jab mera ye course khatam hua tab bhi mera routine set tha ki uh, mm-hmm. ab mujhe coding karni hai jab bhi aapke paas free resources hote hain to aap sochte hain ki matlab ki ab kar lunga kal kar lunga but in the right paid program is not like that you have to be consistent okay. yeah. got it got it तो अपार्ट फ्रॉम मास्टर कार्ड आपके पास और भी किन कंपनीज के ऑफर लेटर्स हैं अभी लेटर्स आई मस्ट नॉट से दैट बट मैं इंटरव्यू uh, में सेलेक्ट हो चुका हूँ सबके लास्ट राउंड तक तो पहुंच ही चुका था जैसे अमेरिकन एक्सप्रेस में हो गया था देन उसके बाद मेरा स्प्रिंकलर में भी हुआ था एंड द थर्ड कंपनी मैं इसमें सेलेक्ट ऑलरेडी हो चुका अच्छा तो वॉट इज दिस वन सजेशन uh you would like to give your self yeah, you gave all the interviews and you came till the round 3 but uh-huh. round 3 clear new by so what is this one piece of advice and suggestion you would like to give ke agar ye kar liya hota to sare shayad interviews all clear ho gaye at that time bhaiya mere paas experience zyada nahi tha in the computer subjects 
मतलब कोडिंग में कर रहा था कोडिंग एट दैट लेवल की मतलब ठीक है मेरे पास ऑलरेडी सब चीज थी उसमें बट कंप्यूटर सब्जेक्ट्स में थोड़ा लैग हो गया था और आई थिंक कि प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग में थोड़ी मेरी शॉर्टकमिंग्स थी कि मैं ज्यादा प्रॉब्लम प्रैक्टिस नहीं कर पाया अगर मैंने ऐसा करा होता तो आई विल श्योरली गेट सिलेक्टेड एट दैट टाइम ओके एंड एडिशनली लाइक एनी एनी पीस ऑफ सजेशन यू वुड लाइक टू गिव टू योर फेलो मेट्स फॉर दिस थिंग अपार्ट फ्रॉम द कोडिंग इफ आई मस्ट से दैट मेंटेन योर सीजीपीए बिकॉज़ कंपनी पहले जब आते हैं तब वो कहने के लिए 7.5 सीजीपीए या फिर 7 का क्राइटेरिया लगाती हैं बट एज हाई एज योर सीजीपीए इज द मोर द मोर अदर चांसेस टू गेट सिलेक्टेड इन सो सीजीपीए प्लेस अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इफ यू आर नॉट फ्रॉम अ कंप्यूटर और टेक ब्रांच एंड इफ यू आर फ्रॉम कंप्यूटर और टेक ब्रांच देन ओके कंप्यूटर स्किल्स मैटर्स अ लॉट फॉर यू गाइस but uh, also the computer subjects as well as programming pro- pro- programming and uh, doing a lot more questions because okay. the question is the only thing that uh, help can can help you to get selected all right man uh, yeah. one more question to you like this is very not so predictable thing uh, can you please tell me in which branch you are studying right now so i am currently in electrical engineering and i just completed my third year yesterday and okay uh, so yeah electrical acha ha so basically my point was to ask like uh, does the branch really matters because there are a lot of students who are very much worried about ke uh, bhaiya i don't have computer science branch will i be able to land up in a good job bhaiya i am studying in mechanical engineering i don't think so i'll be able to get in the job so what is what is the crux matlab jo aapne feel kara hai abhi tak एज फाइल मतलब एज फार एज अगर मेरे एक्सपीरियंस की बात करें भैया तो स्किल्स मैटर्स अलॉट डेफिनेटली बट बिकॉज यू हैव इफ यू हैव स्किल्स देन यू कैन गेट सेलेक्टेड आइर ऑन कैंपस और ऑन ऑफ कैंपस बोथ द साइड्स बट एज फार एज ऑन कैंपस इज कंसर्न आई थिंक दैट ब्रांच प्ले इज अ क्वाइट इंपॉर्टेंट रोल बिकॉज इन द इफ यू आर इन अ लोअर ब्रांच देन यू मस्ट हैव आइर हाई हाई सी जी पी ए और यू मस्ट हैव ग्रेट स्किल uh which right. is comparable to uh, a tech branch student then only you okay. can help so right. all in all uh, what you are trying to convey is that branch is not everything right yeah. if you are skilled enough so you know there is no company which can stop you and yeah. you will be just path breaking in your field right yeah great man uh, apart from this like would you like to tell more about the work culture at mastercard like i don't think so you have seen until yet but you must have heard from your seniors and other people like how is the work culture is it too balanced or is it too hectic so uh, as far as i have discussed with the, my um, with my seniors and all uh, so work culture is quite good there and uh, it's not that much hectic uh, my guess my job is from 9:30 to 6 and uh, okay. yeah so it's quite good and balanced must all right all right uh I don't think so. I should be saying this on this interview, guys. Like the audience, uh, whomsoever be, will be seeing this thing on YouTube. Uh, Mudit, I would like to give you one piece of information. You know, the work life at Mastercard is very chilled out. So uh, I have got a friend who is graduated from IIT Delhi, and he's working there as a consultant. Okay. And uh, honestly, like last last uh, evening, we were having. a talk and he just told me that he worked for only 3 and a half hours collectively in the last 25 days right so uh this is something which i would like to tell you like yeah great yeah. man you have you have cracked such a great company like uh, there's no hectic schedules the work life is pretty chilled out so all the best to you mother uh have a great life and i just hope ke jo bhi aapki aur further dream companies hai aap unko bhi crack karo Yeah. Have a good life with Mastercard too. Thank you. So that's it, guys. Uh, this was our interview with Mudit Tripathi, just me. He has to tell everything about you know uh, his complete journey throughout the DSC preparation and everything about his college. So that's for that's it for today. Uh, let's see you guys in some another success story session. Thank you, Mudit. Have a nice day. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye.